Welcome, in front of me is a POCO F3 and today I'll show you how to enable the power saving mode. And to get started, pull down the notification panel and find the battery saver toggle. That's basically what it's called right here. And as you can see, it is in the top right corner for me. So once you find it, you can simply tap on it to turn it on. You can also hold it to gain access to the settings. Uh, there is a couple of toggles that you might want to turn on or off depending on how you like it. So just read with each one of them and see what you find interesting and what you don't. Now, additionally, Outside of the uh, toggle itself, if you want to preserve a little bit more battery, you can do additional steps which the power saving mode uh, doesn't do. So number one, if you don't need disable location, if you have mobile uh, data and Wi-Fi turned on, turn one of them off and keep only one uh, enabled. This will also save your battery. Uh, then going to the next page, uh, we have, let's see, um, there we go, uh, NFC. So if you are not using it, also disable it. And additionally, as a last option, uh, which will gain you the most amount of battery, it is dropping the max brightness. So if you grab it by like halfway, you will get a significant increase in battery. Uh, so we're talking about like several additional hours just for dropping the brightness. And that is, uh, that is just default. If you're using power saving mode or not, uh, the lower the brightness, the more, uh, the longer the device will work. Obviously, uh, lowering the brightness not, might not always be the uh, optimal uh, choice here, especially like in a direct sunlight. Lowering it halfway will basically render the screen or render it invisible almost like it's off. So I understand that might not be the case for a solution for everybody. But if you're indoors and you can spare that extra brightness, it will give you additional battery life. And lastly, uh, going back to the power saving mode, when you enable this mode, it will disconnect from Wi-Fi and mobile data, both of them, when the device goes to sleep. And sleep is considered this thing. So after a couple minutes, it's considered to be asleep after basically being uh, well, locked and inactive, at which point it disconnects from uh, Wi-Fi and mobile and you won't be getting any kind of updates uh, that will be uh, that are requiring internet connection. So any kind of Facebook posts, uh, notifications that are uh, I don't know, Instagram and stuff like that, you won't get anything until you unlock the device again. So anyway, that is how you would enable it. And once you're done with it, you can simply turn it off, assuming you didn't check that box for a 60% battery to turn it off when you're charging it. So yeah, it's just toggle it off ourselves and the device will go back to functioning as normal minus the toggles and brightness that we have changed uh, separately. So anyway, that is how you would enable it and disable it. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.